Hey, good morning, everybody, and thank you for coming to the Today's Restaurant News Networking Meeting, uh, Combined Meeting, Chapter 1 and 2. We are a group of restaurant vendors who are here to help each other grow our businesses and to also help any restaurant owner, manager, or chef if they have an issue or problem or concern, something like Rob just brought up about food safety, uh, we're here to help. If we can solve it uh, within the group, we have people who we know that can handle it. Um, I want to introduce and welcome three new faces on the board today. Uh, Bernadine, who is, good morning. Hi, good morning. And I'll, go, and I'll double back to you in a second. And Kate Stallings. Good morning. Good morning. And Bruce Auerbach. Those are all three new people. So what I'd like to do is uh, I'll call on each one of the new people individually and just tell us who you are, what you do, and how we can reach you. Because we are videoing this, and this video will be on YouTube, so people who are not here uh, will be able to reach you. So why don't you start us off, Kate, because you are our newest member officially. So, so uh, tell us who you are, what you do, and how we can reach you. All righty. Good morning, everyone. Kate Stallings, owner of Kate Creative Media. I have my office here in Boca Raton. Uh, we design uh, websites for companies all over the country, a lot of manufacturing companies, a lot of food and safety companies, a lot of engineering companies. So uh, very versed in what you guys are doing in this group and love to see it. Uh, I was invited by Andy Rice. We just did the new website for Quail Systems. If you haven't seen it, definitely take a look at it. It looks fantastic. So uh, what I would be looking for in this group is any introductions to companies that you know that uh, don't really have a great website or they're not receiving the leads that they had hoped from their website. Um, there's a lot of reasons why that could be. So I would love to help to mystify the process for them and uh, get them the leads that they rightly, rightfully deserve. Okay. And how can we reach you? Telephone number. Uh, I'll put my information in the chat. Uh, my email is my first name, Kate, at katecreativemedia.com, as well as my phone number is 508-521-4769. And you can reach the website at www.katecreativemedia.com. I'm on all social media channels. If you want to take a look at YouTube, LinkedIn, Facebook, Instagram, X, which is now Twitter, uh, I'm on all of those. So definitely would love to connect. I forgot to mention that at the end of this meeting, I will send everybody a spreadsheet with everybody's contact information that's here. So you don't have to. All right. Uh, let's go to Bernadine. I'm going to get your last name right. St. Deval. St. Deval, right? Right. You got it. Close. <laughs> <laughs> Hi. Good uh, morning. You work with Jeff, right? Yeah, I do. I work with Jeffrey Stevens. That's correct. Okay. So yeah. Tell us who you are, hey. what you do. Okay. Hi, everyone. My name is Bernadine St. Paul. I work for Florida Retail Brokerage. Um, we represent uh, restaurant owners all the time. So the reason for me being in this meeting is to learn more about the restaurant owners because we represent them all the time and we work with them one-on-one. -on -one. Uh, so I figured this would be a great start just for me to get to know the owners and um, hear the conversations that are going on so we can see how we can further more assist you. Um, I can be reached at 561-376-5184. And um, my email address is B Saint Val, which is B-S-A-I-N-T-V-A-L at FloridaRetail.com. Okay, thank you. Welcome. Uh, thank you. Brian, oh, Brian A. Good morning. Um, so uh, Brian Auerbach, I'm with InfoSync. Uh, we are an outsourced accounting and payroll firm. We also do operational reporting for multi-unit restaurant locations. Uh, but probably what's more of interest is any uh, restaurant owner that does third-party delivery with Uber Eats, DoorDash, Grubhub. We do delivery recovery disputes. So we will actually go to Uber Eats, DoorDash, and Grubhub and dispute any claims from the customers and try to get that money back for them, which is probably one to 3% of revenue is being lost to those disputes currently. Um, so I'm here in South Miami, but I can be reached at 786-670-1027. And my email is brian.auerbach at issvc.com. OK, 
Okay, thank you. Uh, okay, so let's uh, start with the members of Brian, uh, Brian J. I guess I'm unlucky. I don't have to follow Chris this morning. <laughs> yeah, I don't know where yeah. he is. I don't know. Um, I'm Brian. I'm with a company called Rogue Financial Group. We are a commercial equipment financing company. I primarily um, work in the hospitality side. Uh, when I say hospitality, restaurants, uh, uh, breweries, uh, bars. I work with a lot of the convenience store side. Um, I do work all over the country. Um, again, uh, we are a commercial equipment financing company. We'll do from small to large projects. Uh, and we also will work with startups and, uh, again, commercial equipment financing. I'm Brian with Rogue Financial Group, 404-723-7222. Uh, Thanks. Okay, thank you. Uh, Darren, good morning. Good morning, everybody. Darren Gall, Tracy.net. We take the aches and pains out of communication and internet services. Uh, we're involved in the restaurant industry, helping to eliminate busy signals when people are calling restaurants. Uh, we also can tie into their payment systems as well as a set fact of when someone calls into the restaurant, we can direct them to online menu ordering uh, for their online menu provider, taking that call off the staff's help by putting an IVR in front of calls before they ring through into the restaurant. Uh, we're also in several other industries. Good lead for us as anybody who hasn't looked at a phone bill in two years or is looking to uh, more modernize what they're doing with their phone services. We can usually save them money and certainly increase their functionality. Uh, you can reach us online at www.traci.net. And that's an acronym for transmit, receive, and communicate information, which was relevant in 1987 when we were founded and is still relevant today. You can also call us at 800-881-8899 or email sales at tracy.net. Hey, thank you. Let's go to uh, Mark and Stephanie. Hi, everyone. We've got Mark today. Hello there. <laughs> How about Hi. that? All right. So, yeah, thanks for having us. I hope everyone had a great Thanksgiving. Um, Mark and I are brilliant computers. Uh, we're out of Boca Raton, Florida. Um, we assist commercial and residential clients with on-site and remote services, including but not limited to business email hosting and, um, and support, online data and operating system backup and support, uh, hardware and software implementation and support, and much, much more. Can't figure out how to change the size of your font? Give us a call. Any other questions um, on what we do and how we can assist you, uh, feel free to reach out to us. Our website's www.brilliantcomputers.com. Uh, the best number for us is 561-877-1119. And Mark here at brilliantcomputers.com, M-A-R-K. Uh, that's how you can reach us. And yeah, thanks for having us again. I finally got a, a response from Meta. Yeah. Yeah. And they said, we'll get back to you. <laughs> <laughs> that's, a, that's a really good answer. Good job, you guys. It's crazy. <laughs> thanks for coming right. back. <laughs> uh, thanks. Uh, Terry R., good morning. Good morning, everyone. Um, my name is Terry. I am the owner of Creative Business Impressions. I am a promotional products distributor, I've been in the business for 20 years. Uh, before I start talking about my company, I want to give a nice uh, shout out to Dwayne, who actually helped my um, office, uh, sanitized my office, and I'm actually breathing better now. So um, anybody who's listening and needs that, please check him out. Um, I you. am, yeah, I am uh, uh, going to uh, introduce a new product that just came out. It's a little bracelet that actually has a little bit of a, it's like a QR code that, I don't know if you can see this thing, I'm trying to see, okay. It has a QR code that you can link to any any part of your um, of your website. It could be a menu, <clears throat> it could be uh, great for events, things like that. I mean, this is a brand new product that just came out. One of the vendors just gave it to me um, and um, I'm I'm loving checking this thing out. It's, it's, uh, uh, Great to keep your um, business on the minds of your customers. 
561-308-1393. Okay. Thank you. Uh, Steve, good morning. Good morning, everyone. I'm Steve Whitehill. Mm -hmm. I happen to be a business broker. I help people buy and sell businesses. Let me give you an example of something I have for sale. It's an Italian restaurant in Sarasota. It does about uh, just under $4 million in sales and it makes a million two on that. And the purchase price is 200 and, uh, excuse me, 2 million five. And with an SBA loan, you can, you can all you need to do is put down about $250,000 and you can buy that. What's interesting is they have a piece of property that they own as well that you can buy for five and a half million. And SBA likes property. So if you combine the two and that would be about a seven, uh, be about an eight million dollar purchase. Uh, you would only have to put eight hundred thousand dollars down, and um, that deal would actually have the, another advantage because it would go to about a twenty five year loan as opposed to a ten year loan. So the payments would be much more affordable. Anyway, this is just one example. I've got about four hundred and sixty restaurants available for sale at the moment in the state of Florida. Uh, my company is. Um, is uh gee, if i could remember my own company it'd be great anchor <laughs> anchor anchor business brokers <laughs> and i can be reached at 561-376-7500 and uh, my email address is steve at anchorbb.com thank you okay, thank you uh chris pumo good morning hey good morning everybody can you hear me all right my name is Chris Pumo, I'm CEO of Skyline Analytics. We're an outsourced uh, fractional FPNA, which is financial planning and analysis, CFO data analytics company. So our expertise is everything operationally finance focused based on data. We look at labor, we look at cost of goods sold, we analyze the data within the business and help them improve flow through and profitability. Um, we work with every single system that's out there. So you name a point of sale system, we've seen it, we've worked with it. Same thing with our accounting systems, CRM. We kind of just bring all that together and then apply our expertise in the operational finance area to help them improve profitability, as I said. Um, easy to get in touch with and love talking about the stuff. So feel free to reach out if anything comes to mind and uh, happy to help the members of this group as well. Okay, thank you. Uh... I'm happy to announce that the, we're opening up a uh, daycare center in this group, and we're going to have Azalea, Stephanie, and Jessica with as the first members of that. Group. That would be uh, awesome. Here's <laughs> <laughs> someone take the baby. She fell asleep though. Perfect timing. I will definitely go to more trade shows once you do that. I'll be able to participate more. Is there a little one? All right, so we're, we're breaking in on new members really early. All right, Azalea, tell us who you are and what you do. So my name is Azalea. I'm a mom of two. Um, I am also a business broker and I do commercial real estate. We're selling about 40 restaurants right now. Um, and I just, I love this group because I like to be an asset to the people that I work with. Um, a lot of them are hard in there just working trying to lift their businesses and i love that i can connect them to a communications per person a website person a pos system like a little bit of everything so i i'm really happy to be here and um thank you for doing this i i love this this group okay thank you how can we reach you um my phone number is uh, my cell phone is 786-457-2796. Thank you. Okay. Uh, John Bung, good morning again. Good morning, everyone. Welcome, uh, new members. <clears throat> my name is John Bung. I'm with the Bung Company. Uh, we manufacture a string tying machine that secures boxes. Uh, we've been in the bakery industry securing the, the box for people to carry at home since the 1930s. Um, and you name it, we tie it. Uh, you probably have seen pork roast, beef roast, rotisserie chickens all tied. That's been our machines since the 50s. Um, so we're here to help uh, eliminate the drivers from eating the food that they deliver. It's up to nearly 80% now. Uh, the bun knot cannot be duplicated by hand. Uh, it's kind of a unique, simple knot. Uh, as you see behind me in the video, it'll, you'll see some pictures of knots in that. 
Um, you can reach us at 1-800-222-BUN, B-U-N-N. Our website is buntyco.com. And my email is info at buntyco.com. And there you are. <laughs> okay. Thank you. Uh, Gabby, good morning. Good morning, uh, Gabby with Worksite PEO. Uh, we are a full service HR outsourcing company. Uh, we do payroll, payroll benefits, workers comp 401k, um, and HR consultation. We'll set up your standard operating procedures, your employee health, um, <laughs> employee handbook, free of charge. And we specialize in the hospitality and restaurant oh. industry uh, specifically. And we have several programs that will actually help them get capital back from the government specifically. Um, we have one right now that is incredibly beneficial for restaurants that majority of restaurant owners, restaurant tours don't know about, which is a FICA tip tax credit. Um, I just enrolled a client um, in Hollywood, 25 employees. They qualify a loan for $35,000 of uh, reimbursement, and we will um, <clears throat> advance that uh, quarter in a quarterly basis. So they will be getting about $9,000 back from us every single quarter. So that's money in their pocket that they can do and invest and pay salaries or take a vacation if they want to. Um, but that facilitates money back into their into their business, into their pocket. Uh, Gabby with Worksite PO, 561-479-7474. Is that, that's not the ERTC, is it? No, no, that's that's just for restaurants. The ERTC is for anyone that had employees or on COVID. Oh, you and I should talk about that. Sure. Yeah, okay. I know. No. All right. Uh, uh, you would be surprised how many restaurants don't know about that, and every restaurant qualifies as long as they are uh, claiming their tips. Oh, okay. Dwayne, good morning. Good morning. How are you? Good morning, everyone. Good to see everyone again. Um, I'm holding on. <laughs> um. Thank you so much, Terry, for, for that warm recommendation. And it was certainly good to see you at the convention. If you remember, the first thing I said to you is like, you sound different. So I'm, I'm very happy to hear um, that, that uh, the treatment helps you. Um, my company is EPOMS, Environmental Peace of Mind Sanitizing. And basically, we are here to help you get that peace of mind in your indoor air quality that we all seek. Um, I use an electrostatic spray system to deliver a hospital grade disinfectant that is a superior um, bleach alternative uh, called Vital Oxide. And I just recently partnered up with uh, the company that kind of pioneered the electrostatic spray uh, domain, if you will. Um, BioPlanet, and Howard is familiar with them. And the show, I, I must say, that was the, my first time attending um, the convention. It was very, very interesting. I, I was surprised about the amount of people that were there. But uh, as far as the end users, I, I, I guess I, it was just getting my feet wet and trying to figure out where my niche would be um so but it was an exciting experience and i was happy to see and meet uh, the uh, folks that attended as well um i service areas such as 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 residents um offices and specifically as it relates to hospitality um obviously restaurants front of the house back of the house the uh, vital oxide uh, hospital grade disinfectant that I use is approved for all food contact surfaces, no rinse, no wipe required. Um, be more than happy to, to go into further detail with anyone that, that has interest. Um, again, Terry, thank you so much for sharing that with everyone. I can be reached directly at 786-738-738. Uh, 
2126. And I encourage you to uh, to go take a look at uh, the website, which is www.epoms. That's E is in Edward, P is in Peter, O Oscar, M S like Sam, by that's B Y D W for Dwayne Wilson. Dot com. Hey, Dwayne, if if a restaurant wanted to use you and they and you scheduled a, a, a nine an eight o'clock spring how soon after can they take over the restaurant again technically um i used to tell people about 20 30 minutes but really once i spray and it settles you can be in the environment i mean again it's a, it's an it's an odor eliminator allergen reducer so smoke odors pet odors etc uh it kills the sars virus uh salmonella it's the product that it is it, so multifunctional. It's, it's amazing. But uh, like I said, delivering it through electrostatic spraying that allows for a much more broader coverage. Um, and certainly on hard surfaces, porous surfaces, safe on skin, uh, clothes, fabrics, et cetera. Um, so there really is no downtime after spraying. Once it settles, you're good to go uh, to go in the environment. Okay, good to know. Thanks. Oh, you know what, Howard? If I may, before sure. um, with the recent publication you have, maybe you know, I'll, I'll talk to you offline. You had a you did a piece on Stephen Tulloch. Yes. Uh, yes. Who? No. I just Stephen want to make a suggestion for Yes. yes. I, I do a lot. We have. Okay, I'm I'm getting cross. Everything's going. Yeah. So what was what was your question, Dwayne? I'm sorry, I didn't hear it. I said I saw an article in your late in the latest publication right. that you did with Stephen Tullock. Right. Has the coffee house in Fort Lauderdale? Yeah, the Ziggies. No, 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 no. Huh? Uh, Stephen Tulloch is a former NFL linebacker. Oh, yes, played yes, 11 yes, years. yes, yes, yes. I've been trying to get to him for for quite a while. So um, if we can talk offline, if maybe you can assist with that or help make that happen. Um, we have a lot of, well, you know how I do things, Howard, and, and I happen to know one or two people, but we have a lot of cross um, areas that we, we know each other. Well, Terry might have that information, so con you know we'll check you out at all offline. Okay. okay. Hi, right. Terry. <laughs> Hi. Uh, I want to make a suggestion. <clears throat> yes, ma'am. Uh, Dwayne, if you go to some real realtors and they're trying to change over an apartment or a home from one owner or one tenant to another, uh, and they want to get the place smelling nice. That might be a good avenue for you. That's a huge market sector. So when they're yeah. doing, when when they're transitioning, whether somebody is right. leaving the apartment, if they're getting the apartment or condo or whatever that space is yeah. ready for a new owner coming in, once they've initiated and Absolutely. done their cleaning protocol, yes, that's when my right. service would be applicable because it's, a, you know, um, over and above right. your cleaning protocol. It's an extra layer of protection, essentially what it is. So you're absolutely correct. You want to get rid of those dog smells? All, all of the above. Right. Okay. Thank you for that, though. Thank you. Yeah. Pam. Pam Hewitt, good morning. Good morning, everyone. Um, hope everybody's well. <clears throat> I'm with Navitas Credit, and we are an $800 million direct finance lender for equipment, IT, software, you name it. Plus, we also uh, finance working capital. We're owned by a $22 billion um, community bank out of South Carolina. So we also offer SBA loans for your clients that are growing or expanding or starting up. And we are probably one of the only lenders in the country that actually will finance brand new day one startups uh, up to 35,000. So if you have any, you know, 
companies that are starting up from scratch, you know, please let me know because they don't have many options. And the credit market for, with the banks and um, credit card companies, they're really cutting back on these business owners. So we pay a referral fee. Just keep your ears open if somebody needs any type of financing, um, we can help them out. And I was a broker for over 15 years, so I'm um, very well versed on, in, you know, helping get clients get. We got a couple of uh, group members that, you know, sell restaurants and all. I can assist with any type of financing like that, even if it's something unique. I've probably done it over the years because I always like to to win when someone gives me a test on a deal. So, uh, yeah, I mean, if, whether you want to just refer and say, hey, this company's opening and I can pay you 2% fee of that. Or if you are a vendor, we put vendor programs together. We do the marketing. We have some great end of the year marketing. And I'll be sending some of that information out to, to the members today so that if it can help you close a few more sales with like mm -hmm. no payments for six months, you'll have it in your arsenal. Mm -hmm. um, so mm -hmm. my name's Pamela Hewitt. I'm going to give you my cell. Is 813-531-0654. And I'll put in the chat my email because it, you know, it's hard right now. Okay, thank you. Um, TR and Terry. Good morning, everyone. Happy everything. They're <laughs> happy. Happy rest of the year. Um, I am the one that handles the getting out for restaurant <clears throat> and those leads are second to none in the industry and we are very mm. proud to have accomplished that after eight or nine almost nine years now we've been doing this we have a list for georgia we have a list for florida covers the panhandle all the way down to key west where that little sign is southernmost part of the u.s anyways um it covers uh, you get the owner's name, address, phone numbers, email address, uh, <clears throat> and 45 minutes or more trying to get just an email or a phone number. It's very difficult. We have a lot of resources that we tap into. Um, um, and that list comes out once a month in an Excel spreadsheet. So you have the advantage of dividing it up by zip code, city, however you have additional people that want to work with these. um there's no way one person's going to cover all these it's not even possible but if anybody that wants to say let me know i'm happy to send it to you uh terry at trnusa.com thank you and you want to mention the price increase not really but i will okay so the price gabby so the price increase no. <laughs> increase yes thank you howard for that is right now the price is 4.99 per year not per month you get 12 monthly reports for 4.99 total january 1st it goes to 8.99 because of additional staff hired to do a lot of this the few people we have we just can't do it all um and more and more leads are coming in so if you're in this group 499 before january 1st and then you are grandfathered in at renewals you do not ever pay any more price so every i know there's a lot of people already getting them so uh you're grandfathered in at whatever you pay um, you never, don't worry about the price. Don't look at it. Doesn't refer to you. <laughs> Anyways, thank you again, Howard. And everyone have a good uh, holiday season. Okay, thanks. Uh, where are we? Where do you go? Kevin. Where, you Kevin. There? Last Sunday, uh, Kevin. Hey, good to see y'all. Hey, uh, Kevin Anderson here. I'm a partner with Strategic Supply Chain Partners. We are a full-service hospitality consulting company. We primarily help small to medium-sized restaurant and hotel groups and any hospitality businesses with how they're set up and structured within distribution. Uh, we manage uh, relationships with broadline distributors, Cisco, U.S. Foods, Cheney Brothers, and so on. Uh, we help negotiate improved overall distribution expenses 
Uh, we also help with uh, deviated pricing with manufacturers that are selling directly to the distributors. Um, we're averaging a little bit over a 10% save for our clients uh, currently, and we are 100% 100 contingency, and basically we find money and we share in the savings that we find for our clients. Uh, we do help with other areas of a profit and loss statement as a client requests. Uh, so we're able to actually positively impact other areas of a, P of a p l on behalf of our clients. Uh, you can reach me at 407-497-9495, or you can look, at, look us up at our website, www.ssc.partners. Okay, thank you. Thanks, um, well, Let's go to our uh, resident restaurateurs, caterers. Uh, the Gottesman family. You, you're good to go. Go ahead. Oh, look at that. Cute. Hi, hi. Yeah, hi, everybody. Good morning. and hope everybody had a great Thanksgiving. We did, too. Um, Helen and I run a nonprofit 501c3 called Delicious Spoon Pools. We employ people with autism, Down syndrome. We do a lot of types of events. Uh, we do weddings, bar mitzvahs, uh, corporate events. Anything you, more or less you can think about. Hanukkah and Christmas. Right. We have actually three events coming up. Uh, excuse me one second. I'm sorry. Uh, just you know, We have uh, just a window open. It's a little bit noisy. Um, we have three events coming up. I have an event this week coming up at the Melgrove Center in Delray Beach. Melagro Center in Delray Beach. It's a uh, center for disadvantaged children. And then on the 13th, we have another event there. But... Uh, Channel 7 News, Darcy Hall is coming down with a TV crew, and they're going to be doing a whole interview on us. Um, also, we have a whole bunch of other press releases coming available uh, this week. We're going to be in, in a magazine called Catering Food Service Events out in Arizona. They have about 55,000 subscribers, and we're also doing other types of uh, functions as well. We're also doing a Hanukkah party this Sunday, next Sunday in Regatta Park down in Coconut Grove. There's hopefully there might be a few hundred people there. We're not sure. It's completely paid for. Somebody paid for our ice cream already. So we're really very excited about that. So, if, you know, if you know of anybody, also, if you know of any pop-up locations that, you know, where, please let us know. You can go on our website, www.deliciouspoonfuls.org to make a donation. And I just want to say that I think everybody in this group is fantastic, very professional. And uh, I want to just want to make one thing. Stephanie, I definitely need your help for computer. So I just want to let you know. I'm happy yeah, we'll to help. You later. Yeah, yeah um, okay, I will we'll put my phone yeah. number in the chat um, and you can send me a text and we'll block I, some time. Yeah, I, I just copied it down when you spoke. And right. that's, I that's it on my laptop number. and my cell phone. Yeah. It'll be yes. in this, it, okay. all that information will be in the spreadsheet that you received. Yep, I just sent okay. it over. Um, oh, wait, right? Okay, I sent okay. it to you. Mm -hmm. Good, thank you. Uh, let me go, I'm going to double back to Bernadine. If, if there's anything that you forgot, or now that you've seen what we do, if you want to add anything? No, I think I got all the information. It was nice to be in a meeting and um yeah i think everything went well and thank you everyone for just um sharing what you do and um sharing more information with us i greatly enjoyed this meeting thank you okay thanks uh, <laughs> chris chris is coming for the second meeting <laughs> hey chris uh kevin has already given us this the lowdown, you want to add anything, Chris? No, am I at the wrong meeting? I thought uh, 10 o'clock Central. Kevin's I... already come and gone. No, no, we're all here. We're all, <laughs> most of us are still here. <laughs> this is a combined end of the month meeting. Uh, was this That's scheduled a... for 9 o'clock? 10, 10 o'clock East Coast. Yeah. Dang it. Everything's East Coast. All right. Well, I guess I'm late. Right. Hope y'all had a good meeting. No, 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 no. That's okay. Well, Mr. Pumo, yeah. how are you? No. <laughs> I want to. I want to mention that, uh, as, as as you all know, that we do put these meetings on YouTube, so you can look at it on YouTube. 
And we also, for members, only have a private Facebook page. And I, I, I post things there, uh, and that is available to all of you to post any questions or uh, if you're looking for something or somebody during the week where you, you can't reach uh, any other member of the group, post it on that uh, Facebook page, which is uh, today's restaurant networking group. Uh, I'd like to get some conversation going on that. Anybody have anything else they want to bring up at the moment? So just to review, we're going to investigate the possibility of the uh, the booth situation at next year's show. And uh, does anybody here want to do a presentation at some point in 2024 early? I uh, would like to start getting some of the members involved with doing presentations. I'm interested. Okay. Yeah, just let, I'm, I'm interested. Let me know where and when. I mean, when. I would like to do a presentation in the 9 and the 11 o'clock, if possible. Uh, I'm sorry, say that again? I would like to uh, do a presentation on the 9 and the 11 o'clock, if I can. Or if I can just do it on the 11, that's fine. Yeah, Sorry, I, to I gotta go. Take care. Well, if you want to, Gabby, you can schedule for the next the joint meeting. Okay. Which will be towards the end of the of uh, towards the end of January. So okay. Give, give you time to put it together. And how about Azalea? Would you like to do a presentation? Yes, sure, but what would I what would I talk about? Like what I do? Oh, I, yeah. I mean, well, just go into into more depth as to what your company does, what you offer, how you do it. Like a um, fair screen, uh, something like that. Yeah, sign me up. There are a lot of restaurants and people that watch this, and you know, we'd like to get everybody in. Yeah, just, perfect. We can know, go ten, for a couple listings, maybe or something. Opportunities. Yeah. 10, 10 to 15 minutes, and then with question Q and A, it's perfect. Okay. I mean, thank Except you. Gabby's gonna do longer than 10 or 15 minutes. She, <laughs> she, she brings wine and stuff. She says, "All right." So anything. Listen, else? what is my name? Gabriella. Exactly. I have to live up to my name. I right. got <laughs> <laughs> <Perfect. laughs> Unbelievable. Oh my gosh. Uh, if nobody has anything else. Kevin, uh, thank you for joining us. Thank you for joining us. Uh, we'll uh, see you all next week. Have a great week and uh, uh, please stay safe. Uh, oh. Let the Howard, be I won't with be you. in. I won't be in next week. We're uh, we're closed. Okay.